What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. Uh, wanted to give you guys an insight as to, you know, what's been going on in the shop, but to start it off, I hit these for retail. You guys already know these are the CPFM. My wife hit for retail. She actually hit both of them, bro. The the spruce and the black ones. And she only paid for the black ones and left the spruce and she didn't pay for it, which I was kind of pissed too. But I just wanted to show you guys a little insight, you know, show you guys my reaction on it. It's my first time actually seeing these, but um, I know there's a bunch of reviews already on the YouTube on that. So I didn't want to go into too deep, but I just want to, you know, just unbox it, see what they look like. And this is the first pair that's actually been in the store, so. We'll see. Bernice, what do you think about these? I wanted to show you, actually. Yeah, we're all behind the cameras already probably seen them. So. No? Yeah. Not a fan. Not a fan? No. All right. All right. Box is dope. They'll, this is the yeah. same box they always do, right? So, Nike. I'm not going to go into too much detail. You guys already, again, probably seen a whole bunch of fucking reviews on these. Pretty dope. Retail boys, man. What do you think, dude? What do you think? This is your first time seeing these, right? I said I like them. You like these? Mm -hmm. I've seen a picture of them. What do you think? It's like a fashion shoe, yeah. So yeah. I feel like the right people can only rock this, man. You're gonna wear a designer, maybe. Yeah, like this is like not your average yeah. sneaker. I mean, it, obviously it isn't. Look, I mean, just look at, look how crazy the shoe is, but I'm gonna say they're dope, but just not for me. <laughs> but they're cool looking. I feel like with the it's more it almost feels more designer wear than streetwear. Yeah, yeah. I, I, but I mean I give props to Cactus Plant for just thinking outside the box. Uh, I think uh, uh, Chase B whenever he had came in the store he said that he was looking forward to these. So um, I mean it's a crazy issue. I mean what's what's marking on these right now like three four hundred or something. Yeah. So I recommend anyone. What do you think? You'd wear these? I feel like I would. It's just like a like black thick shoe. And it's like, I don't know, I feel like these are the trends right now. It's just like big black shoes. What did we see? Oh, there I was like. So, I guess I'm not gonna go too much, but this is kind of cool. Oh, cool. Little things, I guess you put them in here, all around the shoe. Yeah. That's cool. I mean, I don't think we've seen a shoe so different this year. No. Right? Like, like we haven't seen something super crazy so i mean it's good to see something different for for this year what i rate these a seven out of ten you uh six a six yeah you you Bernice? Like a solid eight eight i want to see them at the top so they're cool though but i mean we're, we're gonna post these again i got these for retail so um shout out to yosef for I guess putting in the draw. I didn't even know about the draw. Uh, I think it was like all of a sudden randomly or whatever and then they did the shock drop on Nike, right? Mm -hmm. uh, did you even try on these or no? I'm assuming not because you don't want them. So, I mean, that's good. That's Raul's the man that only cups shoes or tries for shoes that he actually wants and not just yeah. for the resale. So, that's footprint. Any other average resale is just going to try for these <laughs> just because they want to make it, you know, they want to make a quick buck on it. They so. go in the dark. You see that? What? They do? The, this? The bottom. Or the bottom? Yeah, it's actually pretty nice. Oh, okay. That's just that? Cool. Yeah. I didn't even know that, but I mean, for me guys, it's a no go. I mean, I, I might just wear them for the one one time, but that's about it. It's not like an average shoe I'd probably rock every day. But. That's like eight of these. You get to choose where you want them. But there's only five. It's kind of like Croc charms. <laughs> I like it. Obviously, we showed off the shoe, and I want to let you guys know that we will be at Got Soul. Uh, that is November 18th, right? Yes. November 18th, Dallas. We're gonna be on live. Uh, would you? Would you want to say? It's only a one day event. Oh, it's a one day event. So unfortunately, it's not gonna be a two day. You know how normally sneaker con and stuff like that do it. But we will be at Godso Dallas. Um, shout out to Godso for helping us out. We're gonna have a whole booth set up on there. And uh, as you guys already know, we're gonna be buying all day. Um, you know, going around, walking around, seeing if we can buy some heat uh, for the toe and also for just the, sh the shop in general. So stop by, say what's up, and uh, you know, just have, just say what's up, just you know, dab us up and have a good time. Hopefully, it'll be dope. Um, anything? Uh, I don't know if she's gonna go to Dallas, so we'll be on TikTok Live. You guys already know we're always on TikTok Live for the events, which do really well. We're always gonna be coming with us, and then I mean, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens, right? Who? Normally, a lot of people pull up over there. A lot of like the uh, celebrities and stuff like that. So I'm actually interested in seeing who that they're gonna bring in. Probably some Mavericks players. Luca. 
I don't know if they can afford them. I don't know. I mean, we'll see. I, I really hope so, dude. At least that, that dude lively. Oh, that dude yeah. that came in. I don't know if you... Did you watch the game yesterday? No. The Mavericks game? No. No? Cool. That dude went off, so... Um, good to see we're back in we're back in full effect. NBA season back, so it's good to see that we're back in full effect now. All right, homie came in. Four pairs. Uh, all same size, bro? Or is this all personal? Are you selling? Or? Yeah, we're selling them. They're different sizes, though. 13, 12... Is this all brand new or used? Uh, brand new, brand new. Them two are used, I think. Okay, all right. Starting off, Thunder Force. Always need them. What are you asking on these? Say 260. 260? Yeah, Marcus 260. Um, I could do like 240. It's not too bad. I'll wait on those. Is your best this size? Yeah. What's your best? Can you do Yeah. Really? Alright, I can do 250. Alright, so 250, size 13. Put that one to the side. And then Laney's, what are you asking on the Laney's? This is a little bit tougher, bro, because they're 14s. 13. Okay. 13. 13. The bigger size. No, I'm sorry. Oh, 14. I mean, you can Um, Just, you know, I'm going to be a little bit lower on this one than, right. than that one, just because these always fly for us. Okay. Uh, this one I'd probably be at. This is this one new or used? I think I tried them all. Yeah, I think I see that. Um, I'd probably be at two on this one. Two with the Nike though. What's your best? If not, it's cool, bro. Like I said, okay. I'm not feeling on this okay. one too much. Um, what about this one? These I are used, so yeah. keep that in mind too. I seen 150 with no bobs. They look yeah. the same, but I don't know. M me throwing an offer, but I'd probably be like at 100, honestly. Yeah. Because new, they're going for like 220, so I gotta like make money, yeah. sell it in the middle, yeah. And that's like me going a little bit higher than normal. These are used, yeah. right? Too. Yeah. Uh, this one, I'd be at 80 on this one. I guess I just do the four, then. Just do the fours? Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. Uh, do you have cash up? Mm -hmm. All right, we'll get you paid out of it. We were able to get these for 250. Market's 260, so hopefully a lot of you guys don't say that I'm still lowballing. So just because we need them, so. Whenever we need stuff, I'm not lowballing. So 250, size 13, good pickup. I just got a text from Kibo right now that a guy went into our Victory Park location right now with some heat. If you guys know what this one is, just look at that leather on there. Leather's insane on this one. You got 10, 18, 85. You guys know what this one is? The bands. So he came in, came in with those, came in with a pair of Chicago's, and also came in with a pair of, I'll leave, Concords, and I'll leave in one of the craziest ones on there. This one, for you guys, for you LeBron fans that don't know. This one is the LeBron Denims. So they only made 40 pairs of these. Um, I don't know the, the model. Eden probably knows more about this if you guys know who that is. But anyways, we bought all four of them for $1,400 just now. He texted me. So for the ones that don't know, band ones or market use is like, what, $1,500 alone on those? Super crazy. And then this one, it's dead stock. Only 40 pairs in the mirror. I think these are going for like around 2G. So for the ones that know that's watching the video right now, let me know in the comments what you guys think. That's pretty good come up. So sent the man. Oh, that's his thing. But yeah, sent him 1400 today. So got that super dope deal. Um, I mean, we can't wait to see him. So if you guys already don't know, we have the Victory Park location. Uh, once we go over there, we'll show you guys, you know, hopefully we still got them. I think we'll probably still have them. Uh, we'll show you guys in depth of you know what they look like in the condition and stuff like that So yeah, that's dope to see that we just got those so um, Speaking about buying we're now buying Worldwide slash nationwide so if you guys ever want to sell your sneakers you guys can now go on our link on the bio on our Instagram Click this little button that says sell your sneakers to us and you guys can now Sell your sneakers to us worldwide. So I was a little worried people gonna get down suspicious when they come with two bags Oh, no, you're good. What the security? And stuff? Yeah, I was just like damn so, like right. I said, I mentioned, I got these like GOAT, StockX, and Flight Club. So, okay. I'm hoping they're legit, but. No boxes on any? That's what I was telling you. I got no boxes on it. Okay. Only because I moved a lot. I got tired of carrying all the boxes back and forth. Yeah. So, you threw away all the boxes? Yeah. Damn, dude. Yeah, I know. And then, I don't recommend anyone to do that. I know, and I was pretty upset, so. That way, you just that way you benefit by getting more off of it. But she didn't see it. My, my girl, she didn't see it that way. So she's like, "Oh, they're just boxes." I'm like, "Yeah, but they're you know." But they're this. Yeah. yeah so. So yeah. I'm like, "All right, well, I'll just maybe you'll learn next time." Yeah. Gotcha. What are you asking to need tomorrow? 
To be honest, I know those go for quite a bit, but like I said, conditions, everything. Yeah. So. And then the no box and stuff. And then no boxes, so really. What were you wanting for the lot, the whole thing? Did you have a price amount for everything? To be honest, I know a lot of things vary. I haven't really done my research a lot. Yeah. So really, All right, let's, shoot, my, shoot your best shot. Let's start with this one, the Concords. What are you asking? On this one. Shit, I, I know those go for a lot, so maybe. They do, bro. But like I said, considering box and everything. I can tell you clean them off too, right? Yeah, I clean them up. Like I said, they're they're not too, too worn. I know that. Yeah. So I know I try to fluff them as much as I could. What you thinking? Uh, maybe two. Realistic, I'd probably be at one because I'd sell it for two. Yeah, not good. Yeah. What you're asking is what we sell it. Because new, they're like four, but keep in mind, brand new box. It's like, it all, you know what I mean? Um, if it had box, I probably could have done like one, 20, 150, that's what I'm saying, you get a little bit more yeah. uh, with box, but just no box. I, I, in this condition, I'd probably be like at 100. Um, 100 cash or store credit, I could do more on this one. Um, but are you just looking just for cash right now? Yeah, really, no. Okay. Uh, car mines, what do you have on this one? I don't even know. Because I know these were the ones that, uh, they had a defect of the pink. Oh, yeah, yeah, know, yeah. It oxidizes the, or whatever, yeah. and, and uh, the, the red bleeds onto it. Uh, new, keep in mind, these are like at two. So, yeah. use no box, I, I'd probably be right around like 70, is what I'd be at. 70. Uh, like I said, normally these would sell them for like 120. 120. And then this one, uh, off the bat, I'd probably be at mm, like 40. 40, 40 cash. Um, yeah, because these, these don't go for much, bro. This yeah. one. Uh, and then this one, where you at on this one? I have no idea of those. I the 13s. I don't even know the name of these. The altitude? Altitude, yeah, you're right. Yeah. I'd probably be in the same for these. Uh, this one I'd be at 70, this one I'd probably be at 80. It just sucks that you don't have the boxes, bro. Yeah, I know. That's why I knew it was going to kill me when I came here. I'm like, man, it's going to kill me because I don't have the boxes. So around, I'm around like 310. 310 cash. Yeah. yeah. What would make it, subtracting some shoes, what would make it a solid 200 people? What would make it a solid what 200? What would make a two solid 200? Uh, if you had to take care of... Take probably them. these, bro. Those two? Yeah. This That's me going up on this one. On the would, car mics. Would you do that? Well, a bill on bill on these? A bill, bill? Uh, 200? Because yeah. I wouldn't want to sell like all of it, knowing that it's not a lot like yeah, yeah, yeah. value, so I'm like, might as well just take it back. What's, what's your best for the whole thing? Because you said 310, right? Yeah. To be honest, to be honest, I'm not top of my head, I was thinking like four, but like I said, I know with everything going on. Yeah. In that case, I would just really, if I could, I just sell these two then. Just those two? For 200. I can kind of come up a little bit uh, for, for the lot, just because like I said, normally this stuff, don't sell. It, it, it's, it sells just because we price it cheap. It's like stuff like this, we price cheap and it, you know what I mean? Cheap stuff sells, right? So I, and I know because I, I know because they're ten and a half. I know to ten and a half. I know they sell yeah. quite a bit. I mean, I could come up like three thirty for the lot, bro. Three thirty? Yeah, three thirty. Yeah, it just gives me a little bit more to, to work you know. Like I said, normally we try to sell all this stuff like under one fifty. Under one fifty does well. Yeah. Um, just anything under two hundred normally does well. Wow. Uh, but you let me know. Because I could do more store credit, but I don't know if you want to use the store credit or if you're just like just wanting strictly yeah. cash. Well, because I got like I said, I got more pairs, so I okay. might come back. I said, like I said, all of our yeah, yeah. boxes, unfortunately. Okay. Um, if you like I said, if you could, two hundred for these two. I mean, well, together. Yeah, yeah. If you can. Uh, yeah, I could do the two on this one. Yeah, if you could do that, I'll be straight. With yeah, you. I'll do two hundred on this. One. We picked up the Concord Elevens for one twenty, and then we picked up the Carmine Sixes for eighty bucks. These always just move in the shop. I know these are brand new, like around going for like 240 or something, but used is a big market right now, especially in the store. These are always moving for like 150 every day. And then, uh, so you guys already know, we don't have boxes on these, but we have our own rep boxes that everybody needs. Here's about a build. build for you guys. But yeah, we sell these, our rep boxes. Just a little cool thing to just have that way we're not freaking just selling people their, you know, just smelly sneakers just straight up right there and in the bag. So we have that, and then uh, we picked up the concourse for uh, 120, brand new. They're going for like 400 bucks. So these easy went like two bills, two two twenty. I would say no more. Right around like two 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 twenty. So these are always just good movers in the in the store. So that was good to see. And then yeah. All right, so red box done. 
ready to go to sell. Again, everything you guys can shop online, soulplow.com. Just wanted to give you guys, an, you know, a lot of people ask us, word. Actually, a lot of people ask that, can they buy online? Yes, you can buy online, soulplow.com. Link is in the bio if you guys are interested in our Instagram and all that good stuff. So yeah, all this stuff that we, we give out cheap, you know, not only are they available in the store, we ship them out too, right, Abrinis? Ship out. Yes, yeah, so well, right. putting them in the system. Like I said, these do have red boxes, is what they look like built out, but you guys already know that. But I wanted to just talk to you guys a little bit about the um, shoes that are coming out next. The uh, reimagines, man. The Royals. Not looking too nice, man. I haven't seen them in hand. Have you seen them in hand yet? Yeah, I did. You did? Who no, had them? We, we saw them uh, distinct case. Oh, but we didn't even know if they were like, you know, there was a, well, they, you know, they we didn't even that. know if they were legit or not. We they look exactly like that, yeah. They so they were good or they weren't. Yeah, good? they were good. Okay, so that, that that was the whole thing. We saw them early. We saw them like what? That was like months ago, three yeah. months ago, bro. Yeah. Maybe more. So right now, guys, these are uh, scheduled to drop. I want to say the nineteenth. The nineteenth. Did that already happen? It was, oh, uh, it, it was an early accident. I yeah. guess they put them on there. So the official release day on these on sneakers is November 4th. So we have that coming up soon. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about this one. But we've already seen them in person. I'm not a big fan, man. I mean, uh, kudos to whoever it is, but these are just a no pass. What do you think? Uh, I totally forgot. I had early access on them and I passed. Oh, you passed? I didn't. And then what's funny is that, like, after 10, 20 minutes, they they sent another push notification to try to yeah, I was like hey you got early access. they added more sizes and stuff no 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 they were just saying like hey i don't know if you saw but you have early access i'm like basically trying to push it yeah nudge it yeah i was like no nah, i'm good what do you think about this oh, i've seen them they're suede mm. so it's obviously the original royals and then they just added suede on them why are they switching it up satin suede you like these mm, i don't know i'd be careful with them but personally i wouldn't wear them yeah. What do you think? Here you go, guys. I mean, she's not even a sneaker. Uh, she's not a big sneakerhead or something. The fact that she doesn't even want them just tells you that. No, no hate to anyone that actually wants them, but I just think it's going to be a flop of a release. Um, I don't know. We already said, talked about it on Soulcast, but I just think it's going to be a flop. Um, and then next one, the one that actually is actually pretty interesting, uh, which comes out in two days, the Cherry 12s. Funny enough, a lot of people have actually came in the store asking us if we already have them. And right, you said people came in asking us if we already have them already. Yeah, it's been about like since last week they've been asking. Yeah, so it's been it's, like I said, I, I've been personally here. People have actually been asking us if we already have them. We don't have them, but I think that's a good sign to tell you guys that we, you know, we're obviously probably, probably going to carry them in the store. And also, I really think that these are going to do well as far as like, you know, not resale wise, but I just think they're very anticipated because the last time that these restock was what you, we said 2009 yes yeah, so, so 2009 that's been over 10 plus years since we've been you know been waiting on the cherries to drop and I, I don't think you can just go wrong with this for anyone that you know for the ones that are watching i really would say this is a solid shoe to cop um i don't say this too much about 12s and trust me i don't because i'm i don't personally wear 12s but and i probably won't cop these i just don't think it's a bad shoe again i don't think you wear 12s do you I used like, to I used to wear the the uh, from the countdown package the twelve I used to wear those for to who oh you did yeah yeah so uh, I mean you're not gonna I mean I might have to make the switch and cop a, a cop a pair man I mean it's, it's one of the iconic silhouettes that's what I'm saying like if it were any other twelves it it have yeah. to be this one yeah that's what I'm saying any that's what I'm saying for for anyone you know for the ones that are actually thinking about copying it if it if there was any twelve it'd be this one. I, I I passed on those on an offer that I did on Craigslist back in the day. I passed on them because I really wanted the flu games. You have the flu games over these? I wanted those though. It's it's I feel like it's a it's a matchup for me, man. It could be both. Would you take the flu games or those? Honestly, bro, I, I like the white on it. It just pops. Yeah. I, I do the white. I mean, you know, right? White shoes are just very in. I mean, that's why I was talking about the Supreme, the SBs. I thought the white ones were better looking just aesthetically yeah but had they done that on the on the low they would have been better true like resale wise and just like the hype so that, that that's how i was telling that they did the i don't i think i did talk about it already on soulcast that they basically did a good job of making sure that they put the worst colorway on the best shoe and <laughs> though you know by vice versa yeah. so i thought that was a, a good idea on them that they did but yeah so we have uh that coming up but yeah let me know in the comments what you guys think as far as the you know those releases coming up uh and then also the threes 
I think the, they just released the pictures on them. I think I was just talking to you about those. The craft threes? The, the, yeah, the craft threes. Uh, let me see if I can find a picture of them. Who posted them? Uh, Yankee Kicks? Yeah. Yankee Kicks had posted them. Uh, dudes are always posting, you know, the early releases and stuff that they have. But let me know in the comments. This one's actually really nice for a GR. Yeah. Super nice. I, I, I mean, the, here's the pictures. It's like a... I really like how they did that. Which one? The, oh, the Nike right. with the little jump yeah. in on it. Uh, that's originally what they had said they were going to do with the off-whites. Yeah. Those look like the Amamanir 3s. Yeah. They look like Amamanir 3s. It's like 3s. a desaturated. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I really like that. So for anyone that doesn't have Amamanir 3s, Amamanir this is a good pickup. If you have them, I mean, it's, it, it could be a toss-up. Yeah, no, you could either have them or you don't. But uh, this kind of gives me like off-white type of vibes on it. Yeah. The clear soul, the clear soul, the the icy souls, all that good stuff. I, I really like these. I think these are dope. Um, and then, yeah, for anyone that's thinking about these, I think these are a solid pickup. I really think they're a solid pickup. And then we're waiting on these. I'm waiting on these to come out already. No, I'm on, I'm the near fives, yeah. I think this is gonna be a good one. What do you, those are, nice. they're, they're just simple. We've already talked about these on Soulcast, but these are super nice. Uh, again, anyone that's watching, I really recommend you guys to pick these up. Like those over the black pair? I didn't see the black pair actually, uh, but I would say, I just said, like I said, bro, I think the white just, white on the shoe just pops. I like that they did blue instead of yeah. purple. I was about to say that. Because they always add like- They always do that uh, burgundy yeah. type of, yeah, that, I think, yeah. Yeah, so that blue hit really sets it off. Super nice. I, I, I'm i I'm excited more because they're actually doing good colors on the GRs now. Yeah. Which is crazy, because back then it's like, they'd always do BS, you know, GRs and stuff. Now they're actually like doing nice. Yeah. Basically what we've been asking for a while now. I think it was the year that the Black Cement Threes came out, where like that was like a retro, and then like another like the Joker Three GRs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, like what the what the fuck are they dropping those yeah. Joker Threes for? But no, I think they're solid. Again, I, I'm excited to see the next releases are coming up. But let me know in the comments what you guys think. Which one's your favorite? I personally have, uh, for me, I would say those the Amamania Fives. I think that one's like the most like I'm like, you know, excited on that one. And then um. Wanted to mention, fuck, where is they at? If you guys were watching the TikTok live, because you know everyone that comes in on TikTok start actually start coming in here. You guys already saw a guy came in here yesterday, right? He called in, said, "Hey, I, I want to buy the Louis Vuitton Air Forces." I was like, "Bet, come in." The dude actually comes in, walks in with sixty five hundred. Again, uh, I'll see if I can like put a recap of him like putting out the money. I'll, I'll probably send it to you. Uh, he put a he has the money in a freaking wad of cash sixty five hundred dollars He says I want him and I Told him the best I could do was seven because we have these at 7250 with taxes That's around like after taxes. I want to say that's around like almost like eight 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 thousand or something after fees and um, He was like hey man like, you know, I thought it was a solid deal because I think market on these is like last last on StockX, I think Lois has is like eighty five hundred or something like that um, after fees and everything, um, I'll show you guys right now. After fees, they're like lowest ass on them is nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. I think it's a ten or ten half. Is this one? Yeah, it's a ten. So ten US. They're at eighty four fifty after fees. I think it comes up to like ninety two hundred. So I was like, hey bro, seven's not a is not a bad deal. L last sale sixty eight hundred. So I mean the sales were there, right? So uh it was 6500 we basically didn't agree to it he was at 65 i was at seven so let me know in the comments if you guys think that's a, a l on my end but everyone on the TikTok live was saying that i hold my ground that they didn't they weren't gonna like give me shit for it or whatever so what do you think do you think do you think i fucked up not taking the deal dude because i was telling him i was like bro i don't want to be fucking thinking about it like at night just saying like ah oh, shit i should have took the 6500 already he'll come back i think he'll come back because it was like literally guys it's 60 6500 to just you know just to trip about 500 bucks we're, we're not we're not that far off you know we might come back and give you a higher offer yeah so we're at we're again let me know in the comments if you guys think that i took an l on that i personally don't think i told them that with these type of pieces i think these hold hold their value really well just because they people see them as art pieces as well too compared to like a dior jordan one and stuff like that like i think these are more artsy vibes uh, especially with virgil Abloh, you know included in it but i, I just want to let you guys know about that deal just you know just out of the blue guy calls in and comes in with the money so last video i told you guys i was going to cash up somebody a random 25 dollars to a random uh, subscriber slash commenter so today we picked uh dquest 1413 
Uh, Debbie video is cool to hear about the plans for remodeling. Wishing all the best. Appreciate that, man. So I got $25 for you. Go grab some Ruth Chris. Go grab some, some, I don't know. What can you get for $25? 25 McChickens? I don't know. So we got that coming up to you right now. Hopefully this fucking sends right out because we've been buying a lot. So our actually limit's been, been down since we've been cashing out a lot. DQuest, here you go. $25. I'm going to just put a note. Thank you. Thanks for the support. There you go. Danny, appreciate you for subscribing. He was a subscriber and he also, you know, followed the rules by commenting on there. So we will run it again, again, this time. So make sure you guys are commenting on this video. Make sure you guys are subscribed to it. And we probably get another $25 to somebody in the comments. So easy as that, right? What you got? Uh, so I think these are the Nike Air Jordan ones. Black tail, I think is the nickname. Oh, those. those. Super nice. You don't like them or what? Uh, you know, I'm just not a big sneaker guy personally. I, I bought them and I thought I'd wear them and I never ended up wearing them. They're one of the, the better ones, bro, to be honest. Are they really? Yeah, no, the quality's nice. I, I, I mean, the colorway just can't go just can't go wrong with them, honestly. Yeah. What are you asking? I'm looking for somewhere between... I'll start at like 130. 130? Uh, probably do like 110. 110? Yeah. How about 120? Alright, let me see real quick if we have this. You say you're at what? 120. That's fine. Awesome. Yeah. You have cash out? Easy. 50 bones. Brand new? Yeah. Did you have a price in mind, by chance? No. no? Whatever you're offering. What are you thinking? What's your ballpark? I don't want to hear what you're at. Whatever you're offering, honestly, I don't, I don't really have anything in mind. Uh, it's the most you could do on it. I could probably be at 150 just because market's like really low on these right now. 170? Because I was at 180. Um, I could push 160. Five? Huh? 65. 165? 165. Uh, that's cool. Thank you. Sure. 165. Thank you. Right. Maybe one more time. Okay. Um, All right, cool. So, start off with this one. Air Max, four and a half. Yeah, man. So. He's brand new or used, bro? I think I wore them one time. Yeah. I can't remember here. Ooh. Not my favorite out of the out of the three. What are you asking on this one? Uh 190. 190? Yeah. Uh do 170 on this one? 175. That's cool. All right. 175. That's a different box. Uh wait, not the OG box? No. Oh. Yeah. You don't have the original box this one? No. So the Halloween's, right? Yeah. New used? New. What do you want on this one? Uh, one piece. 12 and a half. Good sizes. These so are probably one of the better ones. Do you like these over the, yeah. the other ones at the bin? How much you say on this one, bro? One piece. Uh, this one I could do a bill just because of the no box. One ten. One ten? Uh, that one my favorite. <laughs> They're nice, bro. I mean, I like the little subtle details. I'm barely noticing like the spider webs. Yeah. Like the glow. Oh, they glow in the dark too, the yeah, bottoms? I, saw, I put on Snapchat. Uh, they... Inside. Yeah, right. Here. Little eye. Oh, that's sick. Oh, shit. I didn't even know that. Yeah. Yeah, so you put the price a little bit. Now you know. The... <laughs> <laughs> now you know what they're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Man. I'm going to I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have to upsell that to, to uh, whoever walks in and wants them. Uh, yeah, I could do 110, Rusty. All right. Ooh, cheaters. Don't see these anymore. We were just talking about baseball too. Yeah. What are you asking on this one? 190. 190. I could do 140 on this one. 150. I don't want more time. Not bad. All right, let's go. 150. You don't see those anymore, dude. Gingers. Worn well, once or twice. All right. What are you asking on these? I'm gonna do 150. Uh, this one I'd have to be like at 80, bro, just because they're 14s. I'm thinking about that. Think about this one. One more time. What size is this one? 12 and a half. What'd you say you want on this one? Two. Two? Uh, I'd have to be like at 150 on this one. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Like 150. Yeah, that's fine. It's tough, bro. Like I said. 
for you. I'm keeping these two. Hold off on this one? Yeah. And this. I'm Hold off on this one? Okay. We'll, we'll just get you put on that one. All right, guys. little recap. Uh, we picked up the Saturn Golds, 12 and a half. Uh, super clean, like new. Honestly, these could just possibly pass in the store as just tried on, but... You know, these are in like in like new condition. We picked these up for 175. 12 and a half. Go check your favorite apps for that. A pretty good deal on that. And then this one picked up the just in time for Halloween. Halloween is in about four or five days. Right in time. We got these as a 12 and a half, the Halloweens. Uh, we picked these up for 110. They don't have box, but they are brand new uh, with a replacement box. And a little cool thing. I didn't even know they had they actually glow in the dark, all these like little features that they have on there. Super sick. Whenever he showed me the video. So this is a good one. I think they should probably move just in time for Halloween. And then one that we were just talking about, we were actually just talking about baseball uh, with the Rangers going to the World Series. Uh, Jeter's. Jeter 11 lows. We picked these up. Uh, size 13 for 150. So you just don't see these anymore. And uh, I remember when these came out, there was a, actually a lot of hype on them just because of quality on them. And then um, you remember the highs? They oh, did, yeah. There was the, the, the sample pair. Yeah. Those are going for like 10 plus K or something. And then they announced these, and then everyone's like, oh, well, you know, the next best thing, I guess. So we got this for 150. I think, you know, just 11s in general in the store always move. So stuff like this, we just don't get too often. So these should, you know, move pretty well. Respect on there. So shout out to the GOAT, man. 350s, bones, size 10 and a half, brand new. Got these for 160 or 170. She said 175, no? Yeah, 175, my bad. So 175. Everybody's what do we what do we buy these for? You said 165? Or, or one, yeah, 165, something like that. So we picked these out crazy under retail, because retail on this is like 220, 215 or something. Yeah. It's it's the fact that they're going under retails beats me. I don't know why. These are actually one of the I was telling Raul, these are one of the better 350s that they did. Um these uh, for the restocks yeah from the restocks yeah these are the better ones i would say these and uh the onyxes yeah so you just can't go wrong with them. i don't know why they just don't go for just retail but they probably made a whole bunch so we picked that up low good deals that we got let me know what you guys think if we bought these this one was probably the best one as far as deal wise yeah. i think market on these is like over they're like over 350 or something in this size so ds that was the best one yeah ds and they're like literally like ds so again all these will be available on the website if we still have them by then we just got the golfs. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about those. I, I again, I, I already said I don't know if I said it in the video already, but I don't personally like these. Um, I think you know the cra the crazy thing about it is that they do go for a lot of money, which I don't know why they still go for a lot of money, dude. It, it, it's it's fascinating that these phantoms go for less than those. They, they do. Drop, they drop. I don't know if they drop. I haven't checked market, but in, in the past two days that I checked, the phantoms are going for more or so they're going for less than the golfs. Well, that, yeah, but I think they did drop. Yeah, so I, I, again, Mark has been, you know, a little up and down on those, but we got those, we just picked those up, and, uh, you know, we've gotten, obviously, a lot more pairs of Travis's that came in, obviously, through the buyouts and stuff. We've been filling that up. Got the off-whites in here, and then I also want to let you guys know, a couple of the pairs that we have here are, you know, we sometimes have them a little bit longer than what we normally anticipate, so if you guys are always ever interested in buying any sneakers that we have heat-wise, uh, that are pre-owned we're all ears for offers so make sure you guys are sending those offers in whether it be to the dm or yeah that'd probably be the best way to uh, reach out to us is just send us a dm be like hey i'm interested in like i said these lemonades we've had these for a little bit they do have like a little scratch on there but for anyone that's interested in just having a you know a personal pair that's not too worried about the condition and stuff uh, we have those available and they're already priced like pretty well i don't know exactly off the top of my head what their price i could check or put it on there what we have it at but again we're serious to all offers for anyone that wants to throw them out there you know you won't hurt it, our feelings or anything but uh just letting you guys know on just mainly the i would say we're more motivated on the use heat that we're willing to move it not you know the ds stuff we're pretty much good on that so you guys don't have to offer anything on that but yeah just this is kind of the idea that we have or have currently all these lots unions um all the stuff on the bottom we still have these i don't know why that's i mean that's more of a designer shoe i need to get rid of these anyone that's interested in buying those let me know i can't remember what the name of these are but i mean i think the right guy can pull those off i think i've seen pictures of those before 
And then moving on, Euros, I think you said someone had offered on those? Yeah. Seriously? Or they did? They were just wanting to see where we were kind of at? Yeah, but they said that they were going to come in to check them out. Yeah, so I don't think he's came in yet. So yeah, again, all these are available for you know for offers. We normally don't publicly put it out there, but anyone that watches the YouTube videos and they're serious, just letting you guys know now. Um, stuff like this, I'm probably more of just like keeping it for collector's item. So don't even try to offer on those. And then uh, LVs, I just talked about those that we just had someone offer. So stuff like that we're willing to negotiate on. Um, so I got a whole bunch of the heat on the old school box logos. You guys already know. They haven't been moving as much as I thought they would. Uh, it's still hot. It's still warm. But I mean, it's starting to get cold again. So. Yeah, I think that's a good thing too. It's and Supreme, uh, they're bringing back box logos too. You think so? Yeah, the hoodies, they've been teasing those for a minute. Okay, uh, so I'm interested to see how that goes because, you know, you guys already know Supreme hasn't been in its, at its top notch these past years or so. So, I mean, I think that's one of the reasons why they haven't moved. If we were in 2016, these gone. would have probably already been gone by then. Yeah. So, have those. And then we, you guys already seen the uh, Secret Miles. We've been having those. Um, I don't think those were probably willing on, on selling those. It's just more of like a, you know, just a cool piece have there, especially since, you know, what it represents and stuff. Uh, stuff like this, I do want to get rid of though. So, if you guys are collectors and want and interested in purchasing stuff like that with the briefcase, you know, we're all ears on that. And then um, Chrome Hearts, a lot of people don't know because it's not really, we don't promote it as much, uh, which we should, but we do so, you know, high end, high end pieces as far as clothing wise goes. Gallery department, off white, Chrome Hearts, it's all available on the website as well. So, if you guys want to check that out, soulplier.com and or since we don't have them on the case or in the you know on the rack a lot of people kind of like pass it and don't know that we have it which sucks but they are here for the ones that are you know watching the video they are here the pieces are on the display case so just feel free to ask if you guys are actually interested in purchasing it or trying it on just let the staff know to get you taken care of these i need to get rid of anyone that's interested in some ou's go ahead we have them there feel free to throw your offers and then like i said all this stuff i'm probably not like all this stuff the supreme sbs the new 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 releases and stuff like that i'm not really cool and then we just put the CPFMs on there. If anyone's interested in checking those out too. We'll probably, they'll probably be gone by the time we post them or anything. We actually need to post them too because we just got those two. We're just talking about these. The cherries. Yeah. We were just talking about these today. Too, bro. <laughs> oh, right, well, I, I know. Then I was like, we were like, before you came in, we were like 20 minutes before, we were just talking about these. We were like saying that how we think these are going to do uh, oh, go compared great. to the compared to the Royals, the uh, reimagined. Did you get those? Yeah. The suede ones? Yeah. I didn't even like those though. I didn't either. I, I like the leather better on them. Me too. I just got them just to get them. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you're at, them gonna it's at 250. Um, do 240. I'm kind of like, I normally wouldn't do this. But just because we're like, we just, you know. I know they got to be worth 250 to y'all, man. As you guys know, I normally don't pay like. You I know they so. going to pop. I told but you, see just, what I paid for. Yeah, yeah he paid. I time. really ain't making nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. just doing it just because I had an extra one. I ain't really making nothing. I paid 227 for them. Like, you know, 240? 50, $13. Let me make thirteen dollars. <laughs> Let me make. I mean, bro, I, just, me make, I think Let me just make someone some, will actually man. come and pick them up for whatever we sell them three, three twenty. Nah, them going for three fifty off the rip. You put three fifty up there. Which release down these again? They come out Saturday. Yeah, today so they'll be gone today though. They I think make. regardless of moves, I, that's funny. That's stupid. Let me make something. Yeah, <laughs> let me make something. Let me something. Uh, all used, right? Yeah. What are you asking? Um, at 160 here. I could probably do like 120 on this one, bro. Just because we these, we gotta price them like cheap. And what Where are you at on this one? I'm not Use. sure. Honestly. Uh, you have a ballpark? Uh, like 120. What are these called again? Gym. The gym reds, yeah. Probably do like 70 on this one, bro. Just because of the no box factor on that. I used to. One, how much on this? 120? Yeah, I think I told you 120 on this one. 120, 70. I uh, think one at least 240, but what is that? 210, right? 20, 70. So I'm at 190 right now. 190? Yeah, for the two. Um, I could probably do you a little bit better. I could I could do two. That's that's probably why I'd want to max out for the for the two. Cash, store credit, I could push more, like 230. All right, let me... Let me put these to the side. Yeah, what else you got? And... You guys got the whole bag? 
How much more shoes you got? I just the 12 one. Okay. New? Yeah, brand new. What are you asking on this one? 160. You can do like 110 on this one though. 110? Yeah. And these... These are restocking too, I think, right? Uh, I think so. Yeah, last time I've I seen think. on Instagram. Yeah, I saw on sneakers when I yeah, yeah. dusty all this. Oh, actually that was uh, exclusive access or something. Too. November 3rd, yeah. you guys are doing a big restock. These are nice though, one of the better dunks. Yeah. That they dropped these and the plums and the, what, are the, what was the other ones that they did? It was these plums. The curry. The curries, the curries restock too. Uh, I know Marcus had already played. But yeah, this one's going to be a little bit weird bro, because once that restart happens, yeah. I so I'm gonna probably hold off on this one just because of that. Because the curries did the same thing, so curries break after that restart. Already. So I'm, okay. that's why I'm like hesitant on this right. one. Mm. So I would try to sell them ASAP if you can, like yeah, wherever, wherever you can. Try. And that worst case, I was gonna keep them because they're pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, no, they're dope. That's yeah. the, like I said, that's one of the better ones. Those in the curries. Yeah. Like news, brand new. Uh, I guess you could say try it on. What do you ask for this one? Mm, like 220. 220? Yeah. So bad. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's under market. Uh. Yeah. No, yeah. yeah, I'm not even gonna oh. argue. 220. Brand new? I can't tell if those are new or not. They look new. One of the better twos. Yeah. <clears throat> These are the Chicago's. What do you ask on this one? 120. Uh, I'd probably be at 80 on this one, bro. 80. So 300 for those two, right? Yeah. Three, yeah, so 300 for these two. Uh, we're pulling, I'm pulling the 220. I'm not even going to argue with you on that one. Okay. Um, the already pair of those. Oh, the Fierce? Yeah, the Fierce. Actually, this is my first time actually seeing these in person. Actually, I don't know if there's a market for them, but I was First asking 180. Grade school? Yeah, grade school. And don't they have grade schools out of these? You weren't able to get a men's? Nah. Did yeah. you, was there early access or what? Nah, I think back door or something, I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Last one sold 150. Um, yeah, bro, I'm probably gonna be like right at like retail. Retail. Uh, that's probably safe as bad. Or I know retail's actually higher on this one. It's just these are always once they release. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you? What's your best? What can you do? Uh, probably do like 140, bro. 140. That's like. I was wondering, can't do 150. This one I'm gonna stick, bro. Just cause. 140. Yeah, I'm gonna stick to this one. Okay. Just because I haven't released it, I, I, I'm kind of taking a little gap on that one. Um, that's it though? Or you have more? That's it. Can you do 120 on these? Uh, and I do 140. 120? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so 120. 120. 40. I need time for Halloween too, man. Yeah. 120, 140. When's the release day on these? So late November, so. Oh, so right after, but yeah. So. I mean, if we have them early, someone's gonna pick them up for Halloween, probably. Yeah, I have some more. I have to bring them later on. Right, 120, 140, uh, 220. Uh, I'm at 80 on this one. I'll do 80 on that one. So, no. most far. 80, 80, 140, 120, and then 220. This is right at 560. 560. 560. Just, just take these. And I guess I'll do 200 on these. Two hundred seven sixty. Yeah. Cool. All right, guys. Just as we were talking about these, guy came in, brought the cherry twelves. Off the bat, super nice. I was just telling Raul on the uh, off camera that I actually want a person now. Got these again. Gonna put these in a minute, but whew, it's like fire, dude. On feet. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Am I again? I try. I try not. I, I try to diversify my collection by having a whole bunch of just you know different stuff. And I think this is definitely one of them. I know probably would kill, people are gonna you know roast me saying that you know, but I just I just think that sometimes you gotta have some different shit. What do you think, dude? Do they look better on feet? Yeah, hundred percent. You think so? I guess I'm, I'm probably not wearing the right jeans on them, and I'm probably not gonna rock them on like. The normal guys gonna wear them like with skinny jeans you, you know what i mean that fit i yeah. think you just gotta like you gotta style it right man you gotta put on some like 
straight jeans, some maybe some cargos, you know? Uh, they're sick though, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. Do you guys think these look better on feet? Because I personally think they do, man. So two days, so I'll try on sneakers, and if I don't cop them on there, you know, if you guys want to hook, you know, maybe potentially want to hook me up with a pair, feel free if I don't have them by then. But these should be an easy... Yeah. Like I said, I think the guy over at Snipes that came in said that they're gonna have them for first come first serve, right? So I'll probably try there again. I, I don't see. I don't. I think they're very. They're gonna be sought after. I think they're gonna sell out, but I don't know how market's gonna be on these. But yeah, I recommend you guys if you guys are interested in copying some twelves. I don't know we got them in here in hands. This is a size nine that just came in, so a lot of people have been asking them, but these should sell fairly. And yeah, I, I rate these like a easy like. What do you think? 8.5? Eight. 8? I rate these like a 9. You? Uh, yeah, like an 8. Like an 8? Nah, yeah. these are nice, bro. I mean, yeah. So I'm getting these for personal. And then this one came in super early. These come out in November, right? Yeah. November. Uh, Fear 3s. Um, I'm a big fan of the Fear pack that they did. It was the 3s, the 4s, and the 5s, right? I mean, I'm thinking they're probably going to do the 4s. But overall, I think these are sick. Uh, just in time for Halloween. I don't know why they didn't drop these before Halloween. Uh, Halloween's about to be this weekend, right, bro? This week or this next week, and we're on the 26th, so yeah. it should be either this weekend or next week, Halloween. Um, I don't know why they decided to drop these in November. They should have done these like this month, just in time for Halloween, but unfortunately they didn't. But I think these are fire, regardless for anyone that's you know looking to cop some threes. I think this is definitely one of the better threes that they've done recently, uh, along with the Palominos, the J Balvins. Uh, this is definitely a sleeper one, so I, I you know, I recommend you guys copying this one, but uh, Hopefully if I can get a pair of these for retail for myself, I, I mean, I wouldn't mind copying these for retail again I don't try to just get like a whole bunch of hype stuff um, You know normally It's it's more it's better for me because then I have to like, you know I can clean up my closet and have everything, you know organized and not have as much like clutter But you know, I feel like at this point you know, just buy what you like, I guess, you know? Uh, we only have a size seven. This one came in. This is an early release pair. Uh, I think Marlene might potentially buy these for herself, right? It's right there. She says she's gonna... You say you might or you're 100%? Okay, so she's picking up these. So I guess they're officially sold as of now, but we we should hopefully get some more pairs in. I think the homeboy that came in that uh, sold these to us said he had more pairs. So yeah. just keep an eye on the website. They might be available. Uh, more more pairs available so make sure you guys are tuned into that but yeah just wanted to get you guys know these are some of the quote-unquote early releases that we just got in literally today we were just talking about like upcoming releases and we didn't even talk about these in the upcoming releases uh, which I completely forgot so uh, it was funny so got those these and yeah they're both sick these are solid pickups for if you guys are looking to uh, get anything next month or you know in the upcoming days these two are solid so. All right, guys, that wraps up pretty much this video. Make sure you guys like, comment down below, and also subscribe to the YouTube channel. More stuff coming up soon. And then also don't forget to comment what the best part of your video is as you guys uh, have the opportunity to win $25. As you guys saw previously, I sent over the guy $25, and I think he ended up shouting us out or whatever. So shout out to you, bro, for the $25. Next winner up will be on the next video, so make sure you guys stay tuned to that. And other than that, we're out. Peace. Only $25? Oh, yeah, some guy, some guy had said that uh, only $25? Only $25? <laughs> Bro.